back. We are here with Anna Lee Ashford and Keenan Thompson. Now, Keenan, you are back hosting the People's Choice Awards tomorrow That's night, 9pm, NBC. Andy, you are also nominated for Comedy TV Star of 2022. What can we be most <laughs> excited about? Um, I think it's just a chance for the people to see their favorites, and there's a lot of them going to be in the building. Yeah. Um, and then we're gonna honor some of, you know, some real legends. I think, you know, I think it's been announced that like Shania Twain is getting a special award and like Ryan Reynolds. Ryan Reynolds is getting a special yeah. award. Yeah. yeah. So. Well, our show's been nominated. We never win. You're never kidding. Will. <laughs> never will. You're, you're gonna we, win. We know we won't. You're my choice. You're gonna win. But we won't. Hey, I know, you're both of our choices. Well, that's actually all I care about. You know, yeah, <laughs> it is. <laughs> now, Keenan, you also hosted the Emmys this year. I did. I. <laughs> When we were doing the sketch earlier, right? We were mm -hmm. doing the sketch earlier. I should tell you that Keenan and I rehearsed that sketch about three and a half minutes before this <laughs> show started. Yeah. In a little room it was down with Steve and Tim down there. And I was thinking you would make an excellent late night host, right? Oh, you think? There's one or two spots. One or two spots opening up, baby. Is yeah. this something you'd be interested in? It could be. I feel like the money is in daytime. Right. <laughs> You know, because that's when Oprah was like doing a lot for the world. Mm, yeah, that's syndication money. money. I hear you. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. But I, I mean, I think this show is great and it's very comfortable and we're going to miss you whenever that day approaches or whatever. But oh, we love you very much. Thanks, yeah. man. I love yeah. you too. I do think you would be a mouthy, be a mouthy. There's anything you could do. I mean, you hosted, well, you hosted the Hollywood Critics Association Film Awards earlier this year, Annalie. Yeah. How was that? Did you enjoy doing that? I mean, enjoy is a word that you could use. <laughs> Go on. I mean, the first, you know, the first part of hosting a show, the first 15 minutes, you know, you know, but I mean, you're, you hosting the Tonys is like one of my favorite things that's ever Forget happened. About it. So, oh. so good. Yeah, you. But you know, that first 15 minutes is like an epic thing to kind of get through. And mm -hmm. then you go, wow, my work is done. I'm gonna just slightly listen in case I have to make a joke about what's okay. about to happen. And I was like, if anything goes really wrong, I'll just like hang out with the band and we'll make something up. I'll just, you know, go with the flow. So something went really wrong. Mm. <laughs> Somebody like pushed me out on the stage. And I was like, oh, hey guys, how's it going? And I went to the band and they were gone. <gasps> There was nobody there. So I made lots of weird jokes about bread and I've got celiac disease and who has ammonium? It was terrible. <laughs> it didn't go well. See, Maya, have you ever been in a position like that, Keenan? Have you had to just fill and vamp? Ish. Go on. Um, but not, no, not really. I, I've, I've been lucky, it's you know like what I mean? It's like a fever dream. Yeah, it really well, is. It anyone who's terrible. hosting like a live TV show or anything and they say to me, um, you know, what should I do? Um, I just always, because you know, like you wear an earpiece thing yeah. if it's live, yeah. and I just go, do, just throw them under the bus. Just go, yeah. just go, here, because if someone goes, you need to fill for two minutes mm -hmm. because they're not ready, <laughs> just go, please welcome mm -hmm. you two, and walk off. <laughs> yeah. Right? And, and walk all the way off. Because yep. then no one goes, What's he doing? He's right. lost his mind. Not your problem. Show I am feeling. Right. You do it. There you go. Go on, Bono. Get on. <laughs> now, Annalie, you are... Uh, I want to talk to you about this, Annalie. You're in the middle of a home remodel, well, right? Yes. Always a nightmare. Yes. Are you going to be in before Christmas? No. How is this going? <laughs> really? Absolutely Why? Go on. not. It's not going to be a Christmas miracle. <laughs> um, no. Uh, yeah, our house is not done. And it's been a long time. It still doesn't have walls. Um, we have pipes, that's exciting. Um, and it has a roof, just no walls. So we're like a ghost all the time, just walking through the In walls. In retrospect, do you not think it was a mistake <laughs> to start this remodel and then, should you not have started the remodel before you moved to New York for nine months? I mean... And had it done then? Well, now I'll just be like, blink, it's happened. You know, yes. like you just move and then it, you come back and it's done. I just hope it has walls because I don't want to be like a ghost person anymore in yeah. my own home. You, you, I think everyone wants do walls. Do you need walls? Do you need walls? Do you? I don't know if you do. It's Maybe you can start airy. something new, right? But that's because nice you're a New Yorker oh. and you're used to like, like an open plan. Yeah. Law. I don't need walls, <laughs> yeah. man. Yeah. <laughs> Reggie, do you have a question for our guest this evening? I do. Tonight's question goes to uh, every single one of you on the couch. <laughs> That's us too. Uh, if you were commissioned to create a popsicle stand, mm -hmm. uh, which popsicles would you create? And what would the dimensions of the stand be? 
Would you like to go first? Okay, I would. Um, it would be called dreamsicles, mm. and they would be little unicorns with rainbow braids, and they would have that magic glitter that you can eat, because then you get to poop it out. <laughs> glitter poop. That's great. Yeah. Glitter poop. It's the future. Keenan, <laughs> popsicle wise, where are we at? Uh, popsicle wise, uh, I think I would have the face of a mouse mm -hmm. with like a little bubblegum nose. Uh, black ears, like, on the top. So I would call it Mickey. Mm. <laughs> and, um, that, would be my big, that would be my big hit. As far as the shape of the actual stand itself, uh, I want to say something out of a Tim Burton film. Mm -hmm. So it would be, you know, kind of gorilla-ish, mm. you know, kind of arched, <laughs> weird kind of shaped frame just to stand out in the crowd and lots of triangles. Triangles. <laughs> I love both of these. Right. It's not for me to say. Reggie? Those are correct answers. They're absolutely correct. Please thank our wonderful guests, Annalie Ashford, Keenan Thompson. Stick around. Bazzi is here when we come back. <laughs> <laughs>